Anthropology is distinct in the U.S. because it is broken down into four fields. Cultural, physical, linguistics, and archaeology. Franz Boas is the creator of these fields. He is known as the founding father of anthropology. Franz Boas is a highly regarded name in the anthropology field, just as James Watson is with DNA. DNA's scientific term deoxyribonucleic acid is the genetic material of cellular organisms and most viruses. The gigantic molecule which is used to encode genetic information for all life on Earth. In 1953, a young American geneticist named James Watson and his British colleague Francis Crick had a brilliant insight into the building plan of the DNA molecule that accomplished several things. It demonstrated that DNA almost certainly contained the hereditary material of cells and organisms. It revealed how cells could copy DNA to pass it along to the, their offspring. And it showed how the molecule might change through mutations, which makes evolution possible. The new structure proposed by Watson and Crick caused a sensation in the scientific community because it made sense of some physical measurements that their British colleague, Rosalind Franklin, had made of DNA. DNA is a long chain of polymers, a small compound called nucleotides. Nucleotides are composed of a base, sugar, and a phosphate group. The phosphate joins the sugars in DNA chain through their hydroxyl, the group by phosphodiester bonds. There are four different types of nucleotides found in DNA, differing only in the nitrogen base. A is for adenine, G is for guanine, C is for cytosine, and T is for thymine. The bases pair in a specific way, A with T and G with C. These bases are classified based on their chemical structure into two groups. Aodine and guanine are double ring structure called purine. Thymine and cytosine are single ring structure termed pimidine. The studies that measured amounts of the four DNA building blocks, nucleotides in different species, launched a new era in biology that shifted the focus toward the interactions between different types of molecules in cells. Within cells, DNA is organized into structure called chromosomes. Eukaryotic organisms, animals, plants, fungi, and protists would store their DNA inside the cell nucleus. While in prokaryotes, bacteria, and archaea, it is found in the cell's cytoplasm. In normal human cells, DNA is contained in the nucleus, arranged in 23 pairs of chromosomes. The 23rd pair of a chromosome determines the sex of the individual and is composed of either two X chromosomes for a female or a X and a Y chromosome for a male. Since most eukaryotes are multicellular organisms with many cell types, gene expression must be controlled so different cells' lineages develop differently and remain different. A brain cell is quite different from a liver, liver cell because it contains different proteins even though the DNA in the two cell types is identical. During development and differentiation, different sets of genes are switched on and off. Hemoglobin, for example, is only expressed in developing red blood cells, even though the globin genes are present in all types of cells. Genetic engineering technology has made the isolation and manipulation of eukaryotic genes possible. This has given us some insight into the extraordinary complex process that regulate transcription of eukaryotic genes and allowing fertilized eggs to develop into a multicellular, multi-tissue adult.